so I apologize beforehand if the, um, if the capture is a little bit finicky. Uh, I don't know why sometimes when I capture the screen it just uh, flickers. Anyway, um, basically I'm going to show in this video quickly how to import the flex rig. Uh, so I link the flex rig uh, and make sure you can work with the proxy if you need. Uh, so let's first go uh, to the main character. So I have my character here, right? I'll go to collections and then link the character. Uh, once the character is in, I will go make proxy and choose the rig, right? Uh, now sometimes you might not get all the all this goodies um, because the you'll need to link the um, the script separately. So I would go link if you don't see all the interface here, the GUI interface, the rig UI. Sorry, uh, I would go um, to text and then link uh, link the rig UI panels. Uh, then you will need to go to the text editor, bring it up, and then run it. Once you run it, you should see all the rig UI for the for the car for the rig right there right anyway so you go to pose mode so what i want to show is how you can uh, both use the the main character or the proxy ui for animation um, so let's bring up the arms right uh, i'll go into orthogonal view and then just quickly just set the character however way i want right the head all right so anyway so I made some just like a, a just a random pose, pose right there uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna link the proxy so I'll go file link and then go to collections and then proxies once you link the proxy you'll see that it obeys the rig immediately right uh, all I'm gonna do now is simply just make the character invisible and now i'm working with the proxy itself as you can see it works fine right and this way depending on i guess the computer or uh, that you have you can uh, work with the proxy or you can work with the character rig all you have to do is just once you have your animation set then you just disable the proxy and you should have your uh, final animation with your final character now make sure if, you, if you're having a problem you can always go to the main file and then select the body of the character and you can disable any sort of uh, subsurf modifier or any type of other modifier except the rig obviously but you can disable the subsurf modifier uh, so that the character can be a little bit more, more responsive Anyway, hope hope that helps.